boy Ty Bill, host of the future, Words Network. Oh yeah. Who some of the artists you would like to work work with in the future for Pontiac? <laughs> Come on, man. Remember, remember that shit. Remember sometimes, that shit. sometimes you just gotta reach out, man. Sometimes you gotta um, reach out. I don't know. How, um, be for real though. Some of everybody who who doing something right now, though, I ain't gonna lie. Some people doing doing something. Um, shit, it's a lot of people, bro. I can't even be specific. What side? You see, from the west side, of, uh, from the west, right? Yeah. Okay. Who's some of your people from the west? You, there's a lot of people from the west you, you want to work with. It's a few of them. I like Mac from the west. Like Mac. Yeah, yeah, Mac yeah. Nice. Mac, Mac do his do his thing for sure. Um, Mac do his thing for sure. For sure, for sure. Who the fuck else? Man, mm. we got CSN one. Gun, of course. Gun. Gun and vet, man. Gun, gun get man. old too. We gotta get gun out here. Yeah, yeah. I wanna see I wanna see gun oh, do it sure. at least <laughs> once. You feel me? Big, big again, at least once before he he retired, really. You know, niggas ain't about to be doing this shit right like 50, 40. You got you gotta uh, We gotta be you gotta the thing is you gotta get a check and get out. Mm -hmm. If you make a hundred thousand dollars off rap. That's rap money, bro. You did a job. That's successful, bro. You feel me? If you get a check like that, and, we, and then one check, and you're like, I want to, okay, you did your job. Yeah. You feel me? Maybe your passion ain't in rap. You saying something you want to do in your life. But once you do that, you was considered a professional, in my eyes. Because there's other shit, though, that niggas do to get that cheese. It's not just selling. Yeah, it's not just selling. Yeah, it's not just selling album, man. You got to. Gotta have your hands. Parties, yeah. tour. Motherfuckers might not see no chicken off, t off no albums. Investing in all that shit. But they get the tour. Yeah, you, you, you make your most money on the road. Um, for sure, though. Especially if you're coming off of a, big, a big single or a big album. I you're think, I think streaming, up. streaming, I think streaming ruined, ruined the thing of album, album sales, bro. Cause they even got a to, they even got a merchandise package like yo yeah. yo record label could su could uh, submit to top one hundred a merchandise package that supposedly equal up to album sales that came from some that you know what I'm saying. That's what um what you call it just did. Uh, like they gave it six nine. Yeah, six nine, right? Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. You didn't agree to that or some shit like that. You still flop. Yeah, it's still flop. Right now. That's what I'm saying. Right now. So like yeah, I heard of that before. So I'm not just talking about that. For yeah, man. Um, what you I, think? You like streaming better than uh? You like streaming better than uh? Um, actually, going to go buy the CD. Yeah. No, I don't. It's more convenient. I, no, fuck that. Actually, going to go buy the CD means you actually support that artist. You actually have to get up and go get that motherfucker. They can't be like, oh, I'm sure the crib download it. That's easy. I can hit. You can. You can hit everybody's song one time who just dropped that day, and you giving them a listen. But you not purchasing that shit. Like you probably, of course, if you got the music or something, you getting charged for that shit. But nigga, one one billion, that. one billion. What is it? Um, one billion streams is a million records. That's, that's how it go. Something like that. Yeah, one billion streams is one is, is a million records. So it's platinum. One billion streams. It's, mm -hmm. it's, it's equal, equivalent to. I think I think them streaming the music take did you take away the excitement of rapping like. Because you used to be, it used to be lines <laughs> lined up blocks away just to get niggas new CDs. Yeah, yeah, right, right. I agree to support <coughs> this year, man. It's more, I think streaming more convenient. It is. <coughs> and I think, but, and then, like, rappers could pad, like, they, you could have padded record sales back then, you feel me? That, but look, yeah. I ain't gonna lie. It's artists that still make, make they album release something like the old days because this nigga's like Travis Scott who would drop an album around some shoes and shit like that and niggas literally gotta go hunt for them bitches type shit so it's still kind of the same it still got like a nostalgia that's gonna be built around it when they get old and shit like that people gonna be like remember niggas had the shoes the Travis Scott sixes they was 
look kind of like the album cover type shit. Bro, I feel like, bro, I, if I, what like if, if he put an album, a hard copy album of that shoe, he a sell a million shoes, bro. I feel like it. With the album. Oh God. I feel like more Dad people. Dad buy the album just to get the shoes. I feel like more <laughs> people back in the day, <laughs> albums and shit, like I said, you really had to, like, it's like all this shit, like, like even when people going on tour back in the day, you actually had to be there to see the tour. Nowadays, niggas streaming it. It just take away from the, the actual support of the artist, if you ask me. Now just imagine if, like back in the day, you had to go to the local CD man or go to the flea market or whatever to get the new mixtapes. Niggas would be fucking, it'd be crazy. That artist would be way bigger because you hands on with it. Yeah, you you out in the public more. Niggas had to go to, go to these places and get on and connect with these people, link with these people. Now niggas just send you a DM. Is take away. It's like that's like recording. <coughs> that's like back in the day, songs used to be better when people collab because you had to be in the studio with that person. Build is that still energy. the case though? What you mean, like, no, like with no, songs? No, no. These niggas sending DMs a day, bro. That shit ain't changing their life. But it, but I'm think not. about it. If you was doing that, like you said, still bouncing around, because the record store is not gone. If yeah. you still was doing that. Your fan base would be building still, like the old days, nigga. That's what I'm saying. That's like you still marketing, nigga. Like then you had to nigga. actually get out and meet people. You still do, nigga. No, I'm talking about, like, <laughs> everybody can see you on the internet if you're available. Then you they had to can. You can after you establish your fan base. Yeah. It's not Just, I'm trying to, I'm going to try to do my best to get Pontiac Entertainment scene on the map, man. What y'all got to expect from me? What I got like more coming from me, man. Get on his ass. I'm about to push this bitch to the max, man. All that beef and shit, you can't like, you can't do that shit with me. I don't want to hear. You can't don't ask me about the next man. I don't want to hear about the next man. And you definitely can't come on my show talking about the next man. We blooping that shit. Niggas, <coughs> niggas can't be on here talking about competing with niggas. Yeah, like, that shit like, just gay, not bro. Shit. Worried about the next man is gay. That just make that the rule, bro. Uh -huh. Worried about the next man is gay, bro. That's just the rule. We we 2020 in it. We, I mean, we not even gonna say gay because we support the LGBT community. But LGBT. yeah, we just gonna say, you know, worried about the next man is just is just too gay. That shit not real, bro. That shit not real at all, you feel me? So, we just gonna keep it like that. Worry about the next man, it's from Gazy, bro. So, we just gonna push our music, y'all merchandise, and y'all ideas, man. We gotta take this shit over. Our culture the biggest and strongest culture out here. You feel me? From organs to jeans, bro. We strongest, bro. We running shit. And with the help of every other race, we could be something better than what it is, but we not even gonna just Leave it at that. We're gonna keep working. Keep moving forward. Keep shining, keep grinding, you know, making this shit shape the best yeah. way we can. Get that nigga stack some jokes for being in this phone. Fashion. Fashion, we like fashion, we, we killing it. Fashion, <laughs> like we kill the fashion shit. Oh, oh, I wanna salute, I wanna salute the uh the baby daddy's like, I don't hear the deadbeats no more. Niggas watching their kids through this bitch. Nigga. Shout out to y'all niggas, yeah. you feel me? Yeah. Shout out to Detroit, Flint, uh, you know what I'm saying? Saginaw, Muskegon, Kalamazoo, Grand all Rapids. Right. All that shit, we fuck with y'all. Why, Why you rapping, man? Why you rapping? You feel me? We fuck with y'all the long way. Like this shit, this shit can get bigger than what it is. And we go, matter of fact, we're gonna be doing that shit. We're gonna be hopping in cars, driving out to Grand Rapids, staying in hotels over the weekends, tapping in with you niggas, tapping in with you niggas in Flint, Muskegon, all that shit, bro. When y'all see us, this shit love. Pull up. I ain't got a hang bone in my body. You feel me? Shout out my baby, Driz. You feel me? He making the heat brain behind this shit, making this shit shake. Yeah, man. I love my baby Stacks, man. He's just grinding right now. You no, know, man. I can't press the issue. 
We gotta pick our artists up. We gotta pick our people up. All that shit. Can't kick people down. Even if y'all see me on Facebook talking shit, I ain't got no enemies. I really be talking to ghosts and shit. So <laughs> y'all niggas don't really pay attention to that shit. Facebook, Ty Bell. I mean, Future Bell. Facebook, Future Bell, Instagram. What's your Facebook? What's your Instagram? Um, shit. Facebook, oh. Stacks Escobar. Um, yeah. Instagram, Stacks underscore 33. We out here more from Stacks, man. We gotta get Stacks in the studio. Oh, yeah, man. yeah. Um, he grinding, speaking right? of that, um, yeah. Shit. Oh, 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 we're meaning this shit shake. Hey.